Hello everyone, welcome back again with me on Third Connego channel. Today I wanted to show you static analysis on sensor slip. We will analyze for a connecting route. Like this, without wasting time, let's start it. First step active solid simulation. Go to solid at ins, click solid work simulation, click simulation, click new study, choose static analysis. Make name project is static analysis sensor slip. Okay. Drag this shaft to this position. Hide the component you don't want to analyze. Block this component. Right click, click exclude from analysis. And hide this shaft too. We will analyze this for link plate. The material used is IC1020. Active contact set. Sorry before that, make all shaft transparent. Click this shaft and click transparent. And do the same with other shaft. Active contact set again. Use this face. This face. And this face. Check friction. Okay. And do the same thing to other sub. Click this face. This face. And check friction. Click this face. Sorry, delete this section. This face. Check friction. Now active pin Click this face and this face We use the four parameter Okay Active pin again Click this face and this face Okay. Now we insert picture. Just fit change. Click this face. This face. This face. And this face. Okay. Now insert external load. Choose force. Click selected direction Choose top pen for reference direction Click this Make force parameter is 450 N Because the load reserve is 1800 N And the number of link plan is 4 The load reserve by each link plan is 450 N Check reference direction Click this face Click this face and this face. Okay.
Now mesh and run this study. It will take a long time. Just skip it. Many months later. After simulation done, we can see stress and displacement. Go to stress. Check we need to MPA. Check show max annotation. Choose floating. Max this two. Okay. See, the maximum stress reserved by link plan is 97.77 MPA, and this is a stress area. And what is the yield strength of the AC material? Go to edit material. Change unit to MPA. See, the yield strength is 351.57 MPA. It means the link plan is still safe to accept a lot of 1,800 newton. Now we see displacement. Go to displacement. Check show maximum. Change to floating. Okay. See, displacement on course by. 0.128 mm, very small value, and still safe. Displacement in this area. Now let's see at the force of H pin. Right click result, click list result force. Click connector first. See, H pin reserve a lot of less than 300 newton. It's still safe. Let's try to change the position of link pad and see what are the result. Drag this shaft. Grid mass. Use standard mass. Click run this study and wait until done. See, the results are different. The trust reserve is greater than before, but still safe. Let's see displacement, smaller here. How about the pin? Right click result, click list result first. See, the results are different. In my calculation, the link plate reserves different pressure for edge position shock. I think it's the end tutorial. I hope you like it and can help you to analyze your project. Thanks for watching. See ya.